Can you imagine a world without modern conveniences? Things that we take for granted every day, like video games or iPods, or even something as simple as a plastic soda bottle, take strategy and years of planning to develop. And it's people just like you that have made these things possible. What happens in the future is up to you. Have you thought about what you're going to do when you graduate high school? Or what skills you need to become successful? Most employers look for a well-rounded individual who's reliable, has a desire for success, and takes pride in their work. Well, actually just about any job anybody does, having good computer knowledge and good computer skills is very important because even we have a graphic design department here and they use a computer to design what we make. Did you know that jobs in the electrical field are opening daily as the technical market in this area expands? I was kind of a slacker a little bit, I guess, in high school. <laughs> and I didn't really decide till my senior year of what I wanted to do, you know. I didn't really think about it too much. And then they said, if you're good at math, electronics is a good field. Like People like to hear it. math is, is a huge part of electronics, yeah. If you like math, science, problem solving, and working with computers, then perhaps a job in the field of electronics is for you. The courses that I took was always math science courses, physics, chemistry. Um, English was very important because you need to be able to communicate to people in both written and spoken word. Um, typing was an important class, I thought, because I knew I was going to have to type papers when I went to college and when I went in my field. Because a, a computer, you always have a computer entering information, sending emails, communicating with people, writing manuals, writing papers. Companies all around northeastern Pennsylvania are looking for skilled, talented individuals for jobs in various technological fields. Jobs that let you be creative and also come up with new designs. In, in this company, we're given the freedom to build our own and design our own circuits, buy the parts, and test them and put them out there in the field, make sure they work. And to give yourself a better chance at success, a two-year degree from a technical school or community college will give you additional knowledge that could lead to a high-paying job in the future. Education, I think, is important. The field's moving so fast that you have to keep yourself up on, uh, on new stuff all the time, yeah. Once you get that entry-level position in the field, you gain valuable hands-on experience with the company you're working for that will help you to advance your career even further. A lot of it's on-the-job training, that's constantly, every day, that's what you're doing. There, I mean, when you first start here at Fabrical, you go through, and you're with a guy, you know, you're training this and that, but you don't really learn until you start working on the machines. With the knowledge and skills gained in school and on-the-job training, you can have a competitive, high-paying job in the electronics field. In fact, average starting salaries for many jobs in the field is about $40,000 a year. And compared to most career opportunities, it pays just as much or more without the four-year degree. Because it's like a fun job, you know, there's problem solving, it's something different every day. It's not a routine, boring, you know, go to the office, sit there, do your thing and go home. You know, there's something exciting every day. So if you want a fun and exciting career, technology is the key to the future. Don't just play the game, get in it.